What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Cam ATL, and welcome back to another player prop video with your boy. Drop a like down below because I already know you're gonna love it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Comment anything in the comment section and your name. And to the $50 giveaway I do every single week on this channel, it is Saturday. We have an amazing UFC card later on tonight. We've got a bunch of MLB today. We've got NFL preseason today. We might have uh, Canadian football. I'm not 100% sure. I'm about to find out, though. Uh, we've got eSports throughout the day. Like, we're just stacked up. And Props Made Easy has been on an absolute tear still. I have yet to have a negative day in what feels like months. PropsMadeEasy.com, only $20 a month. Make sure you get locked in. NFL preseason has already been dominating. Canadian football has already been dominating. Football in general has already been dominating. And the season hasn't even started officially yet. So, Let's get with it, baby. All right. Going to the tools to go over these Saturday picks for today. Looking at NFL, let's go over what we got here. So right now, the NFL preseason plays are mixed in with the NFL plays. Dak Prescott is the week one play at 259.5. By the way, these preseason players will be excluded only to the NFL preseason page soon. That's just a little glitch going on right, right now. Right now, the NFL preseason plays are mixed in with the NFL tab plays. Um, but you can kind of tell because all of these obviously are preseason guys. You know what I mean? Uh, so Dak Prescott over 259.5 passing yards at a five sportsbook differential is a great week one play. <coughs> um, Kyler Murray over 231.5 passing yards at five sportsbook differential is a great week one play. C.J. Stroud over 267.5 at a four sportsbook differential. Uh, we have Nico Collins under 69.5 at a minus four. Uh, Kyler Murray's over 32.5 rushing yards at a 3.5. Najee Harris under 56.5 rushing yards at a minus 3.5. Anthony Richardson over 42.5 rushing yards at a 3. Daniel Jones over 87.5. Oh, that's a preseason play. All right, with that being said, let's move on to preseason because week one's not even happening anyway right now. Let's go ahead and touch on <coughs> the biggest spots for NFL preseason. Dorian Thompson-Robinson. First off, I believe this dude's line started at like the 90 something range and they're really they've re really been boosting his lineup. Other sports books have his line at 90.5 passing yards today, whereas Price Picks has it at 105.5, a minus 15 sports book differential on the under Dorian Thompson Robinson. OK, and remember, this data is not just some human being missing something. This is taking legit lines from other sports books where they are setting their lines and coming with an average sports book line from all the sports books that have lines for this and then taking advantage of it, comparing it to prize picks. 90.5 is the average line for Dorian Thompson Robinson on other sports books, whereas it's 105.5 on prize picks. OK, so it's a good spot to take advantage of. Tommy DeVito, same situation, under 103.5 at a minus nine. Hendon Hooker, under 87.5 at a minus 6. Dante Pettis, over 16.5 receiving yards at a 5. Other sportsbooks are at 21.5 for Pettis. He's only 16.5 on prize picks. Des Fitzpatrick, over 11.5 at a 5. Logan Woodside, under 125.5 at a minus 5. Like, we've just got so much values. Such big differentials today for NFL preseason. Definitely lock in with props made easy and get those in. All right. Taking a look at Canadian football, swept that last night. It was amazing. Eugene Lewis, under 45.5 receiving yards at a minus two sportsbook differential. 43.5 is the average. Price Picks has their line at 45 and a half. Zach Caleros, over 283.5 passing yards at a two. 285.5 is his average line on other sportsbooks, whereas he's 283.5 on Price Picks. So solid couple plays there for Canadian football. Moving on to MLB, we actually got a couple greens because I waited a little later to do this video today. Uh, Carlos Rodon, under 7.5 Ks at a 54.46% chance to hit. Minus 146 PME consensus on the under. It gets as high as minus 160 on the under over on Bovada. Projection of 7.4, which is under as well. So great spot there. Bailey Falter, over 3.5 Ks at 54.24% chance. Minus 145 PME consensus. It gets as high as minus 164 on Pinnacle and a projection of 4.42, 0.92 projection differential. So some great spots there for those two guys so far. Let's move on. Let's check Underdog. Over on Underdog, nothing too crazy. Vladimir Guerrero is considerable, seeing that he's up to nine, minus 145 over on BetMGM and a projection of 2.5, a one projection differential. 
Um, he's okay, but I mean, there's other options out here. Like on better picks, Carlos Rodon's under 7.5 Ks over here as well at 54.6. Luis Arreyes over 1.5 total bases at 53.54 percent, minus 141 PME consensus gets as high as minus 145 on Bovada, and a projection of 1.75. Remember, all of these plays that show on Props Made Easy are not just EV; they're plus EV projection. Okay, not only are they EV, but they have projection data on the same side as well. Just validating it even more and that's what takes props made easy success rate to a whole nother level and that's why it does so well you're not just taking ev you're making sure that you're taking ev that has projection data on the same side as well because we all know it doesn't only you don't only have smart betters making a line what it is you feel what i'm saying so you want to make sure that the line the ev is actually legitimate and by smart people by validating it with projection data and that's why Props Made Easy is so amazing and so clutch and so important to have at only $20 a month for this type of data. We spend thousands on thousands on thousands on thousands, almost up to $10,000 a month on our data alone at Props Made Easy. So take advantage of that for only $20 a month. All right. Uh, multiple good picks over on better. You already know DraftKings pick six got the juice. Alex Verdugo under 0 0.5 runs at 61.56% chance to hit. PME consensus is minus 199. When you look at all of the sports books in the industry, the consensus odds when you put them together is minus 199 consensus odds on the under 0 0.5 runs. So great spot there. Zach Gallen over 17.5 outs at 58.55% chance. Minus 174 PME consensus odds on the over gets as high as minus 180 on DraftKings. Projection of 17.6. So some uh, really good options over there on DraftKings Pick 6. And as you guys know, if you're a Props Made Easy member, man, if you've been playing DraftKings Pick 6 with Props Made Easy, you have been absolutely raking. They have been an ATM for us for months now. Nothing on Boom Fantasy. Over on Dabble, Christopher Sanchez under 4.5 Ks at 54.98% chance. Also, many people have been asking me about the first inning runs tool. That will be back where our developers are getting it, making sure that it fits our new layout, okay, which our new layout has been getting so much love. It's so much easier to utilize on mobile, which 90% of our customers are using mobile. Um, I mean, as you can see, I'm on desktop right now. Desktop looks great as well. Um, so it's just been a fantastic update and people have been absolutely loving it So love that for y'all and love that the mobile is that easy like me myself I'll be out on the go pull up my phone and it's so easy to see and understand and all of that now It legitimately looks like props made easy as an app like you're on an app when you're on the phone on your on your uh, When you're on props made easy on your phone. It's pretty sick. Anyway Christopher Sanchez under 4.5 K's at 54.98 percent over on dabble over on Vivid Picks, Bailey Falter over 3.5 Ks at a 54.11% chance. And then let's move on. I'm not going to go through every single one of this video. It'll be an hour long. MLB Fantasy. When it comes to Batter Fantasy, as you guys know, this has been a cheat code as well at Pros Made Easy. MLB Batter Fantasy. Cody Bellinger under 7 batting fantasy score at a minus 1.5. Other sportsbooks have his line at 5.5. All right. Gunnar Henderson over 8 fantasy score. 1.5 sportsbook differential. Other sportsbooks have this line at 9.5. Rafael Devers, batting score is at 7. We like the over at a 1.5 sportsbook differential. Other sportsbooks have it at an 8.5. A lot of value here for batter fantasy today. We have so many at 1.5 or higher, so take advantage of all of those guys. Absolutely great plays there. All right. WNBA, nothing too crazy. Hamby over 9.5 rebounds is a 52.08% chance at a minus 133 PME consensus sportsbook line. All right. Um, so nothing too crazy on prize picks. Let's see if underdog. Underdog has a little bit better with Asia Wilson's points under 26.5 at 52.45% chance to hit. Um, over on Vivid picks, nothing. DraftKings pick six. Even DraftKings pick six doesn't have a ton. Um, dabble. Nothing too crazy. So WNBA, nothing too wild there. Uh, for MMA today, great card on tap for us for MMA today. Luana Santos over 65.5 at a 4.33 sportsbook differential on the over. Casey O'Neill over 78.5 at a 2 sportsbook differential. Herbert Burns under 16.5 at a minus 2. 
Steve Erseg over 60.5 at a two sportsbook differential. Walter Walker over 27.5 at a two. Um, some great, great options. Now, if you're looking for just, let's see if Adesanya has any good lines. Okay, if you're looking just for that main fight, the best option in that main fight would be Duplessis over 79.5 significant strikes at a one sportsbook differential. Or you could go Adesanya's over fight time of 21 fight time minutes at a 0 0.5. But as you can see with the sportsbook differential being higher there, Duplessis would be the absolute best option over significant strikes of 79.5. All right. Like I've been saying, I have a feeling Duplessis wins, but I am an Israel fan. So we'll see what happens. Over on tennis, we got some good value here too. Lerner, Tien. 22 to 22 and a half total games. We like the under at a minus two. Other sportsbooks have this line at 20 and a half. Herbert over 23.5 total games at a 1.5. Other sportsbooks have this at 25. Nicholas Miha, 22.5 under at a minus 1.5. Other sportsbooks have this at a 21. So some really good value over on tennis today. Looking at soccer, nothing too crazy. Roman under player saves of three at a minus 0 0.5. And then Zach over three player saves at a 0 0.5. Taking a look at Call of Duty, gr big value, man. As you know, over at Props Made Easy, we do have the three-man combos. All right, we do have this available for you. So Simp plus a Bezzi plus a Draza. We like the over 169 first three-map kill combo at a 4.5 sportsbook differential. When you look at the average sportsbooks combining these three guys, you're at 173.5. Price Picks only has it at 169, so take advantage. Snoopy plus Cami plus Purge. 144.5 is the line. We like the over at a two sportsbook differential. Other sportsbooks are at a 146.5 average. Okay, so great spot on the over there. So some really good options, especially Simp plus a Bezzi plus Draza is a really good one to put into your slips today. For League of Legends, we got some really good ones too. I mean, we've got four options that are two or higher. Croc, under 7.5 first map kills at minus two. Jansen plus Zven, 24.5 over first three map kills combo. Of two other consensus lines are at 26 and a half. That's two higher than where Price Picks has it. Licorice plus Spica plus Jensen. By the way, this is for all esports. We have the three man combos at Price Made Easy for all esports. Over 25.5 first three map kill combo of two at a 27.5 on other sports books. So take advantage of that one. Niski over 11.5 at a two sports book differential. Other sports books are at 13.5. Really, really, really good options there, man. Some really good esports this weekend. Speaking of really good esports, JBA plus Sonic plus Fizzy on CS2. Under 96, first two map kills combo at a minus four. Other sportsbooks have these three at 92. Brezzy plus OC plus Hexed. 95 is the first two map kills combo. Under at a minus 3.75 sportsbook differentials. Other, uh, other sportsbooks have them combined at a 91.25. Gym fat plus exertion plus torsi 92 first two map kills combo. We like the under at minus 3.5 at an 88.5 on other consensus odds. So we like the under there. Lake solo dolo 14 first two map headshots. We like the over at 2.5 sportsbook differential. Other sportsbooks have this at 16 and a half. I mean, so many good options 2.5 and above. We've got one, two, three, four. We got four options on CS2. Then we've got the big banger over here at a 4.5. Get your eSports, baby. Get your Props Made Easy membership and get those eSports. We've been absolutely dominating. Thank you all for joining me as always, baby. Let's have another fantastic day, and let's just keep ra raising the bar. Keep setting that bar high. Keep dominating. Props Made Easy is only $20 a month, man. Spend more of your bankroll on your actual slips. Stop spending most of your bankroll on the tools themselves. Props Made Easy is different than anywhere else in the industry. <coughs> Not only do we show you where the EV is, but we combine our projection data to make sure you're taking the EV that smart bettors are making it EV. Okay? Not all EV is good EV because you get it bumped by some dumb people sometimes who aren't really researching, who just have a large following and they can manipulate the, the lines. You feel what I'm saying? You want to make sure that the smart people, you're following the smart people. Every play that you see at Props Made Easy is called plus EV projection. Okay, it is not only plus EV is not only does Vegas agree on one side, but projection data also agrees as well. So you can rest assured that you're not betting something that the dumb people have made that way. You're betting something that actually legitimately belongs there. Feel what I'm saying? And that's the difference maker. Thank you all for joining me as always. Go lock in. Let's get it. I'm out.